Right, I'll try and stay away from politics and shit because it's annoying. But this is funny and political. So it's like I'm watching Cracker. Bear in mind this was made in the 90s when England was cool and Manchester in particular. Well, I'm sure Manchester still is. I want to live there for more reasons than one. Anyway, um, yeah, this Indian fellas or a Pakistani fella, I'm not quite sure. I think he's... um. Either way, I've got no beef, you know what I mean? But, um, yeah, he's been killed by a skinhead, and they just assume it's a racial killing, but it isn't. There's more motive going on. But I just love this Indian bro. She's sexy as fuck. White people are thieves. If that ain't fucking racist, mate, imagine it, you say that today about a different colour. You'd be fucking bracelets and nails through your fucking wrist before you could say, hold the fucking phone. Well, fun man. What would it cost to copy the Guardian a large box of those tea bags? Two pounds, four pence. It's on the till roll, yes, and whoever bought them hasn't come forward. The till balance? Eventually, yeah. There was four pence on the floor. Where? Down there. White people are thieves. Where the fuck do you get the balls? What sort of man was he, your father? I mean, was he an exact man? You mean, please keep to the point. You haven't got the time or the patience to hear the nice stuff about him. Just the things that are relevant to his death. I don't mean that, yes. I'm sorry. Would you like to talk about it? He was very exact. The till was always spot on. White people are thieves. Oh. They say they give you a tenner when they only give you a fiver. You've got to know exactly what you should have in the till. <laughs> I love it. How much is this these days? Somebody buys a copy of the Guardian and a packet it, of tea bags. It's one of the best exactly. TV shows of all time, British or otherwise, but. I'm not having a go, I just think it's really funny. White people are thieves. Right now, 